All right, guys. So I have a question for you. Really weird question. And I don't know what it is. Maybe because I lived in New York City and I hold on to old memories and cherish them. Cherish them. What is what is your favorite to, favorite thing to do in New York in November? If you're from New if you are from New York, please state that in the comments that you're from New York and what are the things what are your what are your favorite things to do in New York? It could be one thing, two, three, four, five, name them. If you're not from New York and you come visiting in November, what are your favorite things? Let me know down in the comments below. As an artist, for my fellow artist friends, what do you like to do in November? Good morning. Good morning. It's windy. So windy today. But, uh, it's pretty, pretty, it's so pretty today. Sun's out, fall is still here. A lot of dogs are, are in my neighborhood are outside too. A lot of them are barking and a lot of people are walking their dogs around this time. I usually, I usually walk my two dogs, but I'm off to work today. Slept in a little bit, just a little bit, because I needed to, I didn't have to rush off. Birds are out. It's a beautiful day. Uh, the leaves are just amazing. This one area, I'm going to show you this tree here with all these leaves on the ground. So I have been working on my sculptures, of course, and taking my time, really taking my time, not trying to rush it or anything like that. I'm really just trying to discover the process and enjoying art, not to just make it and get it out there. And I know the holiday season is coming, it's coming fast. In about a week or so, maybe in 10 days, it's gonna be uh, Thanksgiving and then the major outlet of Black Friday and then Christmas and then the new year. But what a year 2020 has been. It has been a challenging year, a very, very challenging year for 2020. I, um, I find myself trying so not to get caught up in a lot of the um, of everything going on on the news. <laughs> I try not to. <laughs> I guess I, I know in my last video we didn't talk too much, I didn't talk too much about my process and show too many things I did on my sculptures but I will try to show you a video where I actually uh, paint it and maybe even resin if I have the chance to. It's just been, I've been so focused on making things and videos is part of a job. I know that, you know, this new YouTube thing, uh, for me, I'm not that new actually, I've been doing it for a while, but um, it's just another part of the creative process, which I enjoy making videos too. And uh, I know I don't, I, I have a, I have, I have about right now, <laughs> I believe seven subscribers and I'm grateful for my seven subscribers. And you think I'm laughing, but I really am grateful. Keeps me making more videos. Thank you guys for subscribing. I really appreciate that. Um, I hope you enjoy the content I give you. And I'm gonna try to make more for next year. I am gonna be, I, be, I will be continuing the singer um, series. I'm going to try to finish her and start her new painting again 
in oils and a larger canvas so be on the lookout for that one very soon that will be my new year resolution project
Hey guys, so this is, uh, we're still going to be in the week of Thanksgiving and uh, a lot's been going on. This is uh, uh, a week where I've been more productive in making art and going in the streets and selling it, but I'm also finding how to adjust my balance, how much time I have to work. Because I work another job not doing art, I have to still learn how to balance my time and spend some time in a relationship as well and to keep myself main, uh, keep my maintenance up as well as being I have to keep my body physically exercising a little bit and I haven't been doing that I lack that and I've been eating a little bit more than usual uh, craving a little bit more food than usual it's mainly the sweets eggnog and chocolate so these are the things that have been going on with me and uh, I find it very challenging but at the same token, I have been selling more, going to the streets of Williamsburg, Brooklyn, enjoying my time there and, and watching the crowds go by and hearing their reactions to my fiance and my artwork. And we really appreciate that. So I thank you guys to my subscribers uh, who have been watching. Thank you guys so much. Um, I'm really appreciative. It's not the member of, of subscribers, but just keep, I'm glad to keep making content of it. So I wanted to go over real quickly um, my basement downstairs my little uh, setup I cleaned up because it's really dirty and I haven't I have to get ready because we're gonna have a, a little bit of people come over with the quarantine we when it can have a limited number but I like to clean up and I, I like to I'm a type of artist that just doesn't clean up after himself too much I clean up regardless after everything's created so because I have a process a process <laughs> but yeah um, yeah I want to take you on that journey let's go All right, guys, so it's December, right early December. It's a Thursday, it's right after work. It's about three o'clock in the afternoon. The sun's going down. And uh, I've just been looking at a lot of YouTube videos lately of a lot of artists that I really enjoy watching on YouTube. Lots of them. Uh, one's called Arlene Bean. Um, she's, there's Sarah Tepes, I think, T-E-P-E-S. Also, I watch um, Carlos Santos, I believe. He's another one. I actually have a large list of artists I follow. Um, but there's this, uh, it's December, so I have this itch to like buy more materials, which I don't need right now. But it's this Hemi gouache jelly set, like this thing going on that looks really cute. It looks like jello pudding to me, like when you open the top of a jelly pudding. I really like that creamy texture, like a chocolate or vanilla. And uh, so I've been looking at that lately. Who knows, maybe I'll get that for, I'll get that for a Christmas gift for myself. I don't know, I'll see if I have my funds. But it is so cold right now in the city of New York, but it's so beautiful. Almost all the leaves are gone, all the brown and yellows. I'm in Staten Island, so all I see is brown now. And I see sunsets now, more sunsets. And, and sunrises because I get up early <laughs> but yeah anyway uh, just want to say thank you guys for watching you might get one I think I'm gonna post one more video before the end of the year and uh, yeah 
just really grateful. So another day, uh, I'll make some more art. And uh, you'll see it soon. Bye guys. <laughs>